Good evening, everyone, and this is Coins and Ghouls on the Live Coin Q&A channel, and I've got another toner report for you. Uh, we have a really nice selection of coins for you this evening. I'm going to go ahead and get right uh, started here. We have a 1950 wheat cent graded by PCGS MS65 Brown. Uh, this one's just got some gold orange toning around the periphery on the reverse and on Lincoln's jacket. Maybe a little magenta in there, but nothing too crazy. But check this sale price out. $652.50 for a 65 brown that doesn't have a lot of color on it, in my opinion. Uh, suggested value on this coin for a 65 red it's $25. So a major, major sale for the buyer, uh, the seller of this coin. Moving on to a Buffalo nickel here. We got a 1931S graded MS66 Plus by PCGS. Uh, I've got the True View photos in there for you. And then the Great Collections photos are on the top. Uh, it's just got some a uh, little bit of gold in there. Really nice kind of gold toning throughout. A little bit of uh, blues, hints of blue and uh, and pink in there, pastel pink and blue. This coin sold for three thousand eight hundred fifty-three dollars and twelve cents. These are all sold on Great Collections too, which includes the buyer's premium. PCGS suggested value on this is $2,250. So this coin did uh, much better than the uh, suggested value on this coin. Moving on here to Mercury Dime, we got a 1934 graded MS67 Plus full bands with a CAC sticker, green CAC sticker. Uh, we got the true views on this coin also. Nothing too crazy, um, a lot of peripheral toning. Uh, you can see a little bit of greens in there, yellow, gold, uh, orange, uh, maybe a little bit of dark brown. Uh, just a really nice original skin on this coin. This coin sold for $1,181.25. Uh, the suggested value on this coin is $750. So uh, the CAC sticker probably really helped on this coin, but a uh, very nice sale and a very nice pickup for the buyer. Moving on here, we got a 1950S Washington Quarter, graded MS67 by PCGS. Also has a green CAC sticker. Uh, this one's just like I said, got the, kind of looks like it was probably an album uh, or maybe even uh, a roll at one point. Got some of that um, peripheral toning on the obverse and the reverse. Uh, I've noticed a lot of peripheral toning, uh, toned coins do bring a nice premium, usually. Uh, this coin also has a blast white um, on the rest of the coin, so it's very, very attractive. This coin sold for $2,327.62. Uh, the suggested value on this coin is $325.00. So as you can see, some a uh, bunch of people really wanted this coin. And that CAC sticker probably really helped on this coin also. Moving on to a Franklin Half Dollar, we got a 1953S MS65 by PCGS. Got the true views on this one also. A little bit of, I wouldn't call it rainbow toning, but uh, kind of has a, some subtle pastel colors in there. A lot of gold and... Uh, brown and a little bit of blue in there so it, it, it kind of looks a little bit rain like rainbow toning but I wouldn't consider this rainbow I don't really have all the uh, colors of the uh, spectrum on this coin but still very very nice coin sold for four hundred and twenty one dollars and eighty eight cents uh, suggested value on this coin is seventy five dollars so once again a very very nice sale Moving on to a really nice Morgan dollar here. We've got an 1885 uh, in a green uh, PCGS slab, MS65 with a CAC sticker. Uh, this coin's just got really nice obverse toning. Um, it, if you kind of look at it, look at the cartwheel on it. 
it just it's gorgeous. Um, really nice blue in there, a little bit of green, a little bit of uh, gold and purple. Uh, just just stunning, stunning color on this coin. This coin sold for five hundred and thirty-six dollars and thirty-four cents. Uh, suggested value on this coin is $285, so this coin did really well. Uh, moving on to the Crazy Toner Honorable Mention this week, this, <laughs> this report. Uh, we've got a 1946 Iowa commemorative half dollar graded MS-68 with a CAC sticker. And I've got true views on there also. Uh, as you can see, it got some really nice, uh, almost uh, pastel blue and, and purple in the uh, center of the coin. And then you got the really nice deep red and gold and orange from the peripheral of the coin. Uh, really nice, stunning color on this coin. Coin sold for $7,941.38 on September 25th, 2022. So this year. Uh, PC just suggested value on this coin is two thousand dollars. So, mm, three plus times the uh, suggested value—that's pretty good. And then I got the viewer submission this week. Uh, Chris or Coolatech um, is on his email. Uh, he's got a really nice uh, seventy-four uh, Eisenhower here. Gorgeous, uh, beautiful baby blue toning with a little hints of purple in there. Um, really, I love the color on this coin. I would um, love to have this in my collection. Congratulations, Chris. Very, very nice coin. Uh, I'm still accepting toner submissions, so if you want to send in your coin uh, photos to me at the LiveCoin Q&A email, info at livecoinqna.com. Uh, photos, uh, tr great photos are required, okay? So cropped. Um, nice, not blurry, very, very nice uh, presentation. Uh, I'll take true views. Uh, I do raw or graded, and then I just choose uh, choose one every uh, every time I do a a report. Please write your name on a little piece of paper and put it underneath the uh, slab or the coin to show ownership. And I appreciate you all joining me. Please like, share, and subscribe, and you all have a great weekend. Thank you.